anyway, we finally got out of the lines for our Christmas dinner. And this was, uh, probably something on January the 15th, you know, it took two weeks up there. But anyway, we had this uh, Christmas dinner. <laughs> That's another funny story there. It got some English people when we were all half pissed. They came up and they, uh, they wanted some fucking tea, so we sold them. No, we didn't sell them. We gave them all the goddamn tea that was in the, in the fucking shack. That was just half a dozen of us guys. They would say, I'm sure you have the whole goddamn work. And they gave us a couple of bottles of goddamn whiskey. So anyway, we're half pissed. But anyway, the next day, now we're heading back to the lines, eh? And we're fucking, you know, we're, we're hungover, fuck sick, you know, whatever, throwing up and shit. And, we marched about 10 fucking miles and then we dug on this goddamn hill and there was about six inches of snow on the ground and we had some picks and shovels and I whacked that pick into the ground and fucking bounced right up. It was like hitting cement and I thought, holy Christ almighty, you know, I'm 5,000 miles away from my mother and this is what I'm fucking faced with and I said, if I ever come out of this shit house, I'll never be cold again. Mm. End of story. Yeah. Right. We finally did dig in and you get through the first foot, you know, and you get down to some soil you can dig in, we dig in and, and there's the odd shell folding in here, you know, and mortars and artillery and shit, you know, and you figure what the fuck, you, know, you don't know if one's going to land it on top of you or not, neither, you know, so yeah. it's part of the experience.